Hey Gemini, thanks for viewing my general tarot scope for December 2018. Uh, remember these readings are based on collective energies for zodiac signs with astrology. Um, use the resonating messages as a tool to shed light on issues that need, that need your attention. Uh, get a reading where you can ask personal questions and get personalized advice. That's my suggestion. Um, my donation information, Instant Go and Venmo are in the description. Now let's get it. So for Gemini, December 2018. We're using the... I forgot the name. Okay, it's called the Witch's Tarot. We can call that the overall energy. Four of Wands. It's pretty. <clears throat> December 2018. Waiting for the cars to decide to talk. There you go. The star. Hmm. That is Uranus. <coughs> Aquarius. Aquarius card, but the star also uh, is, you know, in addition to being a major arcana, is also a wish card, you know. Eight of Cups. It's not a wish card. <clears throat> seems like it seems like in this eight of cups. Uh, in this, uh, in the star card, you see seven. There are eight stars in the sky. Okay. <clears throat> eight of cups. Eight stars in the sky. It's almost like this Eight of Cups is not saying that it's it's not the same feeling. It's it's as you know generally the Eight of Cups would mean you had enough, you're walking away, something like that. But with this, it feels like you're being tempted. You're being lured away towards the star. Um, it's like there's the star card has all these stars and you're looking up in the sky and you can see all those stars from this card here and you're just curious. So you're heading towards the stars. Heading towards your wish 
Four Pentacles. Then we got the Four of Pentacles in reverse. Eight of Cups, basically saying pretty much the same thing, walking away. Ace of Swords. <coughs> Starting with a fresh view of the situation. Nine of Wands. <clears throat> so you got your defenses up. On this new journey. <clears throat> One more. We can get one more. Is this an emperor? That's the king of wands. So let me. There's the King of Wands. <clears throat> and we'll take one more just to have total clarity. But it's looking like the new mental clarity brings courage and passion that you let's see I feel like I feel like we should take another card um it brings courage and passion that you were lacking before let's see um you weren't lacking it you just didn't need it um but with the king, with the, the nine of wands, <clears throat> you take on a new movement, right? So you take on some movement, you acquire some property, uh, you may be acquiring some property um, you may be purchasing a home maybe um, look at the king of wands here <clears throat> oh that's two okay that's a lot okay we'll leave this one <clears throat> So this could be, like I said, acquiring new property, maybe a car or a home, um, karma in reverse and the hermit. In reverse. So <clears throat> the well, we should clarify. Let's 
Okay. We're going to clarify karma, which is this card here. It's in reverse. So that's what we're clarifying. You also have the hermit in reverse. So it just looks like you you got a goal. There's a goal here. And you can't you 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 see a path to accomplishing this goal and you just can't sit back you just can't sit back and not follow these steps <laughs> you just have to keep moving forward but it's good because the you win the battle so we clarify karma with the two of swords and the king of cups let's clarify the hermit and you just For karma to be in reverse, clarify by okay, okay. Ugh. And the hermit clarifying the hermit, but. It's like this. One of them's in reverse. So let's do this. Looks like Gemini. Whatever your whatever the plan was that you put in place or that's been put in place for you. Um, you may have a you may have a strict a strict workout regimen or a diet that you have to stick to <clears throat> or you may have a financial plan like um, a financial planner um, that is helping you um, save money towards uh, a new asset like like I said uh, maybe a car or a house or maybe you're purchasing a business or um, I, I can't say it would be a purchase I don't see any pinnacles on the table um, <clears throat> I don't see you know all I see is that you have a plan and it's a plan that's the fuel for the plan is all um, is pure uh, adrenaline or whatever is natural that whatever is natural that you produce that it, you know it's, it's pure testosterone you may be a woman it's pure adrenaline but you're moving towards accomplishing this goal and you do accomplish the goal it looks like with the six of wands that's the victory card but 
karma is in reverse, <clears throat> which is justice. Is it? Um, judgment. This is judgment in the regular rider weight. And it could mean a setback or a delay. But it's clarified by the King of Cups and the Two of Swords, which indicates possibly a crossroads. There's two different ways you can go. Um, if this is related to a relationship, or if this is about a relationship, then Gemini, you may be hold on here. You may be you may have a Virgo coming in. because we got the hermit he's in reverse he's in reverse and upright but it's like he's holding up this light and he's looking down and you're I want to say let's see here Okay, so this Eight of Cups could indicate a Pisces, a Pisces energy that you may have coming in. There's also See Virgo Pretty much all signs are represented. Let's see King Okay, so it looks like with the karma card in reverse, clarified by the two and the king, this is a challenge that. I want to say you will have to overcome. Hold on here. Okay, so. The star is is where your is where your reading starts.
and it ends over here with the hermit clarified by the hermit. That's just, I mean, this is something new. The star is something new or possibly a wish fulfilled, um, a miracle. And it's going to be there, whatever the miracle is. I want to say when I said you may acquire land or something like that uh, land or it may be a relationship it may be a person a person of interest um, Okay, so we do have the King of Cups. All right. So you have a miracle. You have everything you need. You... You're on your way to it. You have to come get it. And you're on your way to it. You have to let go of something. You have to leave something behind. This could be a job. This could be a, a lover, a relationship, family. And when you leave them behind, that's your new start. Your, your fresh, um, clear in the head, nobody in your ear. Um, <clears throat> you come out ready. I mean, you're ready for the world, you know. <clears throat> and then and, and I, some of this may have been in the past I'm, and I'm, I'm thinking let's see you may have already left family or someone behind or a job you may have already left that person behind or that situation behind or that job behind and you're ready for the next phase let me just get some clarifiers the star oh clarify the eight of cups I'm gonna clarify everything but <clears throat> I'm really interested to know what the king of wands is and who he is to Gemini. 
because he he looks like he run he runs things. Like he running this. So um the four of pentacles in reverse. We got the ace of pentacles clarifying the eight of cups. So could be a work situation or could it could even be a physical relationship. Let's see. The fool clarifying the four of pentacles in reverse. Clarify the ace of swords. Lovers just showed itself. Ace of Swords clarified by the lovers. with the nine of ones. Is there hmm. I guess I say just pick one. So the star is clarified by the ten of swords in reverse. That means that hmm, how is the star Okay, let's just say the, that this is related to, this is relationship related. There goes the star clarifier, the nine of wands. Let's say this is a relationship and the relationship is hard. It's a mental burden is driving me crazy. Um, you just want out, but you just can't figure out how to get out. You're not able to get out. You might may not even want to get out. But here we have the Ace of Pentacles clarifying the Eight of Cups. It looks like the Ace of Pentacles is passing a coin from the sky. It's, it's like they're holding a coin from the sky over, over your head and you can see it and you're going for it. Clarify the King of Wands, please. And you can see it, and you're going for it. You 
you don't know what to make of this offer, but you're going in the direction of this offer. It would be like a new start for you. Um, this looks like a job. But then it's turning into, looks like it's turning into the lover. So either there's a choice. Maybe you have a choice of a job position that you could take. Or there is a, a man or woman that you're very attracted to you want you want this person um you know the lovers could just be your own energy coming in real strong in this reading and that is clarifying the ace of swords this is so nice like uh we got one two three Okay, four, five. This is nice. So, um, with the two, okay, we got 30 minutes. I'm going to finish this at Vimeo. Uh, I'm just going to look further into, I'm going to clarify the King of Wands the lovers and the two options that uh the, the the ace of pentacles and i'm going to do another clarification another clarifier for the ace of swords and i'm, I'm going to clarify how you come out as the hermits here in the end so uh catch me at vimeo on this one and thank you for watching uh, like, subscribe, comment, um, feedback is always good. Thank you. Bye-bye.